Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm gonna be teaching you how you can add your own continually playing background music. So if you have watched my other tutorial on sound effects, then you basically know the concepts, but this is gonna be just a little bit different for continually playing background music. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna right click workspace, insert object, sound, just as we did before. And now what you wanna do is you wanna focus on the sound ID. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into toolbox, Instead of explosion, let's just look up some music. Now, I might get copyrighted for this, so I'm probably not gonna um, actually play the music. It'll probably be something different, but let's see. Uh, let's... So now what you wanna do is you wanna find the uh, background music to your game. So I'm just gonna try a bunch of them out and see which one I like. So I'm gonna use this cool vibe so right here, because I think I like it. So if you click on the blue text, then it'll add the sound object. So that basically means we don't need this anymore. But if you have your own sound ID, then you can just paste it into here and it'll end up like that. So this is gonna be my background music for the game. So I'm gonna call this background music. And now what we have to do is we're gonna have, to, we have to play this and we have to play this continually because it's background music. So if you wanna preview, you can click this green button right here. Okay, so now if you want to actually play this music in the background of your game, you want to add a new script into server strip service. And then you want to take this thing and you want to make sure looped is set to true. What this will do is it will actually loop your uh, your sound. And now it is literally one line of code, believe it or not. Because all we have to do is we just have to play this music. And it will literally just continually play as long as this looped is set to true. So all I have to do is get this music and play it. Well, if you think about it, where is this music located? Well, it's inside of our game and the workspace is inside of our game and this music is inside of workspace. So you start with game because this whole thing is game. And then you go, you, uh, you continue with workspace, that workspace, and then you find the background music. So you say dot background music. And now all you have to do is play it. So you write colon play. And you're done. One line of code. So play the game and your background music should be there. And it is. And suddenly this base plate looks a lot more interesting. <laughs> so that is it for today. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video.